All right, mom, are you ready to uh, chill? Welcome back to Ask Me to yet another fun review featuring my wonderful and lovely mom. Mom, welcome. Are you excited for today's review? Mm -hmm. Want to tell the fast foodies where we are going for today's review? We're going to Pot Belly. Yes, we are going to Pot Belly. Now, Pot Belly is primarily known for their sandwiches. They are pretty good sandwiches. Okay, now we go to Pot Belly. We've had Pot Belly before. We've had their sandwiches, okay. yeah. I think they're usually a little expensive, but they are, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. They're, they're high quality. But along with sandwiches, Pot Bellies also makes cookies and shakes. And today we're actually going to be trying a brand new milkshake. Now, before I tell you all about it, I actually have to tell you a story. I was actually going to go to Pot Belly to, I think they came out with a, at least I saw online that they were supposed to come out with like a new, some type of cherry cookie. So I went to Pot Belly and I show up and I'm like, do you guys have the new cherry cookie? And they said, no. I was like, we're, they're starting that, <laughs> they're starting that next week. And then I saw a poster for a, a, a new Dulce de Leche cookie. So like, do you guys have that new Dulce de Leche cookie? Dulce. Dulce. And they said, no, we're out. I said, well, what do you have? And they said, we do have this brand new, you know what it's called? Um, is it my? Cinnamon churro. Cinnamon churro. Cinnamon churro milkshake. How is the new cinnamon churro shake? It's pretty good. Actually. Pretty good? It does taste like a churro. It does? All right, I hope so. I like my churros. <laughs> and so, even though I had no plans on reviewing a milkshake, I decided why not pick it up and let you guys know. Yeah, with all, all, cook, all the, yeah, it's like, what, pop -o. You see it says pop on there? Yeah, so I think all milkshakes come with that. But uh, yeah, so today we're gonna let you know if it's any good or not. Now, I do plan on going back to Pop Bellies because they gave me a receipt, obviously, when I bought this, and they said if I fill it out, then I can bring it back, and I think I get a free cookie. So, uh, yeah. yeah, well, they have it. <laughs> but anyway, back to this. Uh, oh wait, to make sure they don't miss out on those reviews of the new cookies or any of the new fast food products that I review, Mom, what do they do? Hit the button, subscribe. Go ahead and do that. All right, Mom, you ready? Yep. You want to take a spoonful? Spoon. All right. Okay, I'm that big. It's gonna be full. <laughs> Mm. Mm. That's good. It's almost like a mm, milk sorbet. It's like there's so much ice in it. Yeah, yeah. It is it's a little icy. Nice. Yeah. But the flavor is like a horchata. Yeah, horchata. Mm -hmm. You guys have had a horchata. It's like a Mexican rice cinnamon mm -hmm. milk. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. That's pretty much. I wonder if they use, use it for this. I wonder. You know what this kind of tastes like? Have you? Ever, you've never had cinnamon, or when's the last time we had cinnamon toast crunch? Mm. <laughs> it kind of yeah. tastes like if you took the milk mm -hmm. from cinnamon toast crunch mm -hmm. and made it into a milkshake. This is. Uh... Yeah. So at the end of the day. I guess I am kind of happy. I think I enjoy this more than I would have enjoyed that cherry chocolate cookie. So if it was chocolate, I know there was cherries in there. I forget what else, but uh, yeah. So lesson learned mm -hmm. here today, Fat Foodies. Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. <laughs> All right. Especially, bad <laughs> Especially at Bob the Hoist. Yes. Although you do know that you will get a good cinnamon churro milkshake. That is for sure. Want to give this mm -hmm. rating? Mm -hmm. All right. Three, two. Nine. Seven and a half. Just because for me it's a little too watery. Like Water. I would expect milkshake like thicker, thicker, creamier. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But a good flavor. Yeah. All right. I hope you guys enjoy this one, and we'll catch you back here with some more that's foodie reviews. If you made it to the end of this video, then I'm sure that you want to become a fast foodie as well. So all you have to do is hit that subscribe button, and to see exclusive behind the scenes footage. You can head on over to Instagram and follow the Fast Foodies at Fast Foodies Review.